There he is, ladies and gentlemen, the man of the hour. Oh yeah, I forgot I hadn't uh, done that just because I was like, I don't feel like, I don't feel like it. But what a, well, okay, what a way to wait, a hand. Piranha plant. All right, so we got the green and yellow. I forget. Um, I think that is based off. Um, cause like I saw some video talking about the different skins or whatever, but like I'm pretty sure that one's based off Paper Mario, cause in Paper Mario games the poison piranha plants are yellow and green, or oh no, they're yellow and red actually. Well, that's the closest thing to it anyway. Maybe, I mean, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe there's no red, but I know that there's yellow on the poison piranha plants in Paper Mario. We got, let's see, we got Yellow Boy with a nice pot. We got this one's cool looking. I like this. It's like a berry piranha plant. Oh, uh, we got the black one. We got this one is cool. Look at the leaves. Uh, then we got purple, and then we got this one's cool. But now we're gonna go classic on this one. All right, Palutena, get ready to be chomped. Oh, look at that. Look at that entrance. Oh, look at him go. Ow, fuck you. Ooh. All right, ow. Uh, huh. Hiya! Pot smack! Ow! Oh! Okay, side B is a poison. Ooh! He has like a little s explosion spit. Almost. That was cool. Oh, God damn. See, the thing that sucks about unlocking Palutena is that you have to do it on this stage, and that sucks. There we go. All right, nobody cares. Oh, look at him. All right, we got. Why does it sound like that? <gasps> It's so sad. That one. I like that one. E. Yeah. And that that's a good one too. Ugh, oh, just his run is so good. Look at his little feet. Hang on, we gotta where uh where is time? Oh, look at his little feet! He's got little feet. Um. Oh. <laughs> I'm just gonna. Whoa! Look at that. Damn. This nair looks great. All oh, his little feet. His little feet. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> you know the door stoppers they go like dang oh wow okay that's a pretty good recovery that's like fully controllable like you can either go straight up and get a lot of that way height or go to the side that's a very good recovery <laughs> all right no don't go back uh hang on i want to oh that down air is cool i mean a down throw i meant And they got the forward smash based on those guys from Mario Galaxy. Okay, we got, hang on, we gotta try the specials out. All right, munch. <laughs> it's the munch. So you blow on it. You hold it to keep blowing on it. Oh, 
And if you tap a direction, he tosses it. Oh, and it bounces a little. And then he gets all sad if it's not there. If there isn't one. Uh, okay. So yeah, that's definitely like his edge guarding tool for sure. Cause you could just kind of, really easily. Oh well, or you could just do that, you fuck. Uh, okay, side B is a charge, and then I start farting, and then. Okay. And of course, you know, you could just release it early, but let's, like, try to get him in the full thing of it. That's a lot of damage. Can I just, like, activate that whenever? Like. Okay, well, it didn't really do much there. But if I were to, like. I can throw him into it. So yeah, that's, it just creates like a big just damage box. It's pretty good. Um, and so his down B is that. And fucking munch. Wait. Okay, so once you tilt over to a side, um... Oh, but when you... Oops, that's not what I meant to do. When you're in the air, you can change it more. Oh, no, yeah, but still, once you turn to... Once you choose a direction to turn with that, you're locked into it. Oh, th th his down smash was one of my favorite things from the the trailer for him. Because that part where he, like, knocks, like, Game & Watch and uh, Jigglypuff into, like, the sides of the Mario stage. Ooh. That can hit Mario. Cool. And it looks very good. It looks like a very good up smash. I mean, it would make sense if that was his best smash because, you know. But, oh my god, the fact that. I could potentially kill with that. Hang the fuck on. Okay, maybe not with the just it, the startup on its own, but if we like, um, so if I was like, that that has potential, that has potential. So far, the best looking things on him seem like his nair, his uh, up smash, um, maybe his back air. Ah, oh, I I th this is gonna be good. All right, now let's get into some actual fighting. And right, now for some actual combat. New Bloom. As he... <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> Ow. Whoa. <laughs> Good. No. <gasps> Thank you, Girahim. I owe you my life. Grrr. Oh, look at him. The one attack I thought he would have, if, if you had told me Piranha Plant was in Smash Bros, it didn't show me anything about him, I would have assumed his neutral B would be shooting a fireball, considering... <laughs> Good. Wait a minute, hang on. Is it just going by, like... I just noticed, it's going by newcomers. New Bloom, oh, okay. Yeah, okay. That just happened. Uh Let's pretend that didn't happen. Oh, that super armor is good right now. Oh, yeah, suck my dick. Uh, okay. Eh. <laughs> I poked him. I gave him the big old poke in the nose. Pro play with the fucking gun. Wait, hang on, hang on, hang on. That's just Waluigi. That's just a Waluigi. That that's a Waluigi. He snuck into Smash. All right. We tried him out in training. Put him in classic. 
Now we're going. Okay. That hit me how? Oh, oh, what? Okay. Yeah, I'm definitely going to be at a disadvantage considering I'm one of the few people who didn't just like... Oh! Oh, okay. Look at him clap! Look at him clap! Ah! Ah! So he is now the only character other than Krom that has another fighter in his victory animation. The only other character is Robin. He has Krom. Which is still really funny to me, because then Krom can win and lose simultaneously. See that, yeah, that's Lucina players. They just sit in one spot and just keep forward airing at nothing until you're like charging something. And then they use counters because counters are a fun part of this game that everyone enjoys to use constantly. We have yet to find out if uh, Prana Plane is gonna be a character that's better on Battlefield or Omega. Cause I feel like most characters, most characters are gonna, oh, I didn't mean to fall down with that. Most characters are good on Battlefield, but some are only good on Omega. That was stupid. She was dumb for doing that. Let's go gold pot boy. This piranha plant plays so much competitive overwatch. He's just too powerful. All right. Oh, oh okay. I thought I had a jump, but I didn't. I also hit air dodge, but whatever. I tried to go down through the platform, but it just didn't work. Fuck! Yes! <laughs> Worth! <laughs> Good. Oh, and you can shield it. But it... No, oh, okay. Ugh. Okay, you know what? Smart ass. Oh, whoa! Oh, okay. No ledge for me. Okay. Yeah, these are the kind of Mewtwo players I hate. There you go, good. Just up smash every single day. Why do so many people think you can do stuff like that at the ledge? People have get up attacks. Like, I feel like more than half of the players I see online don't know about the get up attacks. Or they know that they can use them, but they don't know that their opponents can use them. I really like that. Whoop. Ah, uh, it's it sucks that you can't like drop it straight down, but then move out of the way to just drop it straight down the ledge. That would probably be too good though, because that is a strong projectile. Whoa! Huh? That launched far. How do you do that? How do I do that? And ouch. Oh, okay, so yeah, it's when it's low is when it goes farther. Interesting. You would think the opposite. I would think the opposite. But I guess now that I think about it makes sense. Also, great, I'm gonna lose. Alright, nair kill. That's what we're doing. <laughs> Yikes. No. Fuck! That sucks, because you... I mean, it is a, I guess it's a way to balance it, because you are very large when doing that. So just as a counter, you're kind of putting your hitbox all the way over there. Oh, and here we go. Someone who actually wants to have fun tonight. Oh, no, he doesn't! He wants to play on Pac-Land! See ya! Ooh. Oh! <gasps> Ooh, that was good. That was pretty good. <laughs> Enjoy that percent, ass nuts. Oh, okay. That's what I, I always find that so weird. The people who like lose their stocks 
and then keep going and then just get angry and leave. Like, not even, like, after you do something really good to them or, like, they fuck up or anything. No, you're just, like, fighting them normally and then they just leave. It's like, oh, okay. Oh, no, it's another- Big Chungus! Get ready. <laughs> I forgot what my things were. Oh, um, okay. What? Oh my god, he's the, the epitome of projectile spam. Because he's the only person I've ever seen actually using the beam that Link fires when he's at, uh, when he uses forward smash at 0%. He just loves projectiles that much that he's actually going to use that. Ugh, fuck the platform. I just want to throw a thing at him. Wait, how many stocks did we have? Did we each only have one? He's a one stock Dark Link projectile spammer. If that isn't the epitome of what's bad about the Smash community, I don't know what is. Well, look where that got you, pal. Okay, I brought him back onto the stage. Good job, me. And there I go! And there he goes! Alright. That, though, isn't either. Okay, does he have any good throws? I wouldn't imagine, honestly. It doesn't seem like a character that would give good throws. And Okay, are you just gonna... See, this is gonna. This is the kind of guy who's gonna make people say, "Wait, Piranha Plant is OP," because he's just gonna spam, and people aren't gonna know how to counter it because people are dumb. Oh, God, I love it. Ah, uh, he's, he's interesting. I, I don't know if he's gonna be like a big main of mine, just based on just how I've been, just based, just based on tonight. I don't know if I'm personally gonna like be a big main of him. But I'm definitely going to play him a bit, because he seems goofy. His, generally, his moves just kind of seem a little bit slow and clunky, while others are very fun and weird and wacky, and I want to use those. But the, uh, most of his moves, most of his basic moveset just seems a little, just kind of clunky. I mean, that's kind of what I was expecting, honestly. I mean, he, he's a guy that just goes up and down all his life. You, you can't expect much. But what we got so far... Seems pretty good. Oh! oh! This is the best Kirby skin of all. By far. Oh, look at him! Look at him! I even got sad. Look at him. Oh, Kirby could do some wacky shit with this neutral special. Ho ho. Wait. Gulp. <laughs> oh, Kirby could do some really wacky stuff with that. That's good. <laughs> 